Hello everyone and welcome to another Mass Valkyrie episode. In the previous video, as you noticed, I showed you how this Mass Valkyrie attack is used in farming and I was smashing max Town Hall 9 bases in farming and now we're gonna see some war attacks as well. So I'm visiting in an arranged war that was done right after the update. I think it, it is between Indian players and some of my clanmates from Winner Ever Came are also, have also participated in this war. So he's using a bit different combination on this one because there is a lava hound in the clan castle he decided not bringing poison spells because they're totally useless against a lava hound and he decided bringing four earthquake spells and only three heal spells also notice on the left that five of the valks are going outside the base and this is due to a bit bad funneling so he's gonna try save the situations with a couple of hogs now before all those valks are gonna die anyway as I said, this is a bit different combination. The one I'm using is 4 heal spells and 2 poison spells. And this is definitely something that you should consider when you're attacking a base. If it's a fresh attack and you have no idea what's in the clan castle, I would definitely recommend bringing the poison spells. But sometimes you can use the earthquake spells to open up a lot of compartments. And this will help the Valks when they're smashing through the walls. I mean, they don't have problems with those kind of walls. But if you can help them, and if you don't need those heal spells, you can definitely do those. So he's also using a couple of hooks, which I'm not using. And this is definitely something that I do recommend doing in Wars, because you don't have to bring a lot of hooks, and they can do a lot of damage. And on this one, you notice that those hooks done a lot of damage, and he's getting a super easy overkill with two swag heal spells. Only few buildings are left, lots of Valks are left, and this base is going to go down for 3 stars. So there's something that is a bit different after the update, and this is the way you're using your heal spells. You gotta make sure to pay a very close attention to the Valkyrie health. Remember that after the update, their hit points were reduced, and this makes them very vulnerable. Not only because of the hit points, but also because the Wizard Tower well buff were buffed and now they're making a lot more damage so you gotta be very careful at some at some point the attack became a bit easier because the valks are doing a bit more damage but on the other hand it became harder because they get less hit points and now the town hall 9 defenses are more buffed and are doing a lot more damage especially the wiz tower and the expos so i think that overall the attack became a bit harder because you gotta you gotta make sure that you're paying a lot of attention to a lot of stuff during the attack and you gotta make sure that you're dropping the heal spells in the right timing and in the perfect location otherwise you might fail especially in war attacks so in this one that was so perfect that they didn't even need all the heal spells and again using earthquake spells on this one and hogs to make sure that you're doing a lot more damage to the base. This is, some, this is definitely something that I do recommend. And you should try that in war as well. It takes a lot of practice to get used to the attack. But after you get used to it, after you start mastering it, it, it it's totally unstoppable. If you do it the right way, I think that you can smash almost every Town Hall 9 with this kind of strategy. And again, not using a heal spells. Heroes are almost fully alive, and I don't know how many Valks are left over there, but it seems like all of them, all the ones that started, nah, I'm just kidding, but some of them are definitely left, and this is another easy 3-star. The third attack that we're going to see is by Anurag, and he's my clanmate in Winter Ever Came, and although he's done an attack against Town Hall 8 defenses and pretty high-level heroes, I don't want him to cry later, so I'm gonna show his attack as well. So, <laughs> anyway, he's starting with the Valk, sending one hog to get rid of those defenses, and then he's gonna start the main attack. So, he's using again earthquake spells, just in, like in the previous attack. Learn the clan castle troops out. Remember that poison spells are not really working anymore, and if you're gonna lure the clan castle troops and just drop the poison spell, those are gonna go out of the poison spells and are not gonna be effective. So, those times when you just lure the dragon and drop the poison spells are not working anymore so you gotta make sure that you find other ways to do that i think that this is going to affect town hall 8 mostly 
because in Town Hall 9, I don't think that many are actually luring the Clan Castle troops and then using the poison spell. I mean, probably some some do that. I don't really do that. I just kill the dragon with my queen and, and the wizard. I think that the kill squad is usually enough to deal with the dragon, but in Town Hall 8, you don't have a queen, and if you don't want to bring a lot of wizards to your attack, you might mess up because if there's a dragon over there and you don't have the wizards, there's pretty much nothing that can stop them and it can be a lot of trouble. So I think that Town Hall 8 will be affected by this update a lot and I think that Town Hall 8 battles, especially against the dragons, are gonna be much harder. So on this one he got a very easy 3 star on this Town Hall 8.5 with Xbos. Now nah, just kidding, it's not a bad base. It got some lower defenses, but it's still a very impressive attack with two SWAT kill spells. So this was the last one. Don't forget to check out the guide on how to do this attack. It's a bit different than in the guide because you gotta pay a bit more attention now to the Valks, but the basics are very similar and you're gonna master it after watching this guide. Just go practice a bit as well. So if you're new on the channel, I would love if you subscribe. We'll see each other in the next video. Bye-bye.